Picture a horse standing under the hot sun, breathing deeply after an intense workout. The sound of hooves still echoes in the distance as he slowly walks toward the trough. Within minutes, he drinks enough to fill nearly an entire bucket. But what does this simple act really reveal? Is it just thirst, or is his body sending a silent signal that something needs to be balanced? A horse's water intake is much more than a basic need. It's a mirror of his health, metabolism, and even his state of mind. And the right or wrong amount can mean the difference between a strong, thriving animal and a dangerous case of dehydration. Today, we're going to uncover how much water a horse truly drinks each day, what influences that number, and what every sip says about his well-being. A horse's body is made up of about 60 to 70 percent water. That means a 500 kilogram horse carries more than 300 liters of water within his muscles, blood, and vital organs. Water is the invisible fuel that drives everything from nutrient transport to temperature regulation. When a horse moves, his blood warms, sweat evaporates, and with it, vital minerals like sodium and potassium are lost. That's where hydration becomes essential. Water is the link that allows every system in his body to keep working in harmony. A horse can survive several days without solid food, but rarely more than 48 hours without water especially in hot weather. And the fascinating part is that his body is a master at sending subtle signals of thirst, but humans don't always notice. The amount of water a horse drinks can vary dramatically. On average, it ranges between 25 and 55 liters per day, or roughly six to 14 gallons. But those numbers can easily double under certain conditions. A horse at rest, living in a mild climate and eating fresh pasture, will drink less because grass contains up to 80% natural moisture. On the other hand, a horse fed mainly on dry hay, which is less than 15% moisture, must drink much more to compensate. Temperature plays a decisive role too. For every 10 degrees Celsius increase in ambient temperature, a horse's water intake can rise by as much as 40%. That means a horse on a hot summer day of 35 degrees Celsius may consume 80 liters of water, about the same as a small household tank. Exercise level is another key factor. During a race or intense training, a horse can lose four to six liters of sweat per hour. That loss must be quickly replaced to prevent decreased performance, muscle cramps, and even a dangerous condition known as Monday morning disease, when muscle fibers break down due to fluid imbalance. Diet also influences hydration. Horses that eat grain-rich diets tend to drink more because their digestive systems need extra water to process starch and keep the gut moving smoothly. So, how much water does a horse truly need each day? The answer depends on his lifestyle and workload. A horse kept at pasture or for light used generally drinks between 25 and 35 liters per day. Horses in moderate work may drink 40 to 60 liters, while racing or high-performance horses can exceed 80 liters daily. In other words, an athletic horse can drink in one day what a human might consume in 10 days. To put that into perspective, imagine a horse drinking eight full buckets of water every day. Over the course of a week, that's nearly 600 liters, the same as filling a family-sized bathtub seven times. There's another interesting detail. Studies show that horses drink more when the water is slightly warm, between 50 and 70 degrees Fahrenheit or 10 to 20 degrees Celsius. Below that range, intake can drop by up to 40%. That's why in colder regions, many owners install water heaters to maintain the ideal temperature. Now imagine a horse that for some reason doesn't have constant access to clean water. Within hours, his body begins to change, blood becomes thicker, the gut slows down, and the first signs of dehydration appear. Sunken eyes, dry gums, dark urine, and a noticeable loss of appetite. As dehydration progresses, the horse can become lethargic, sweat less, and even show mood changes, becoming restless or irritable. The danger is that these signs often appear too late. Research shows that losing just 5% of body water already affects athletic performance, 
and losing 10% can lead to collapse. The digestive system is especially dependent on hydration. When water is lacking, the intestinal content becomes dry and compacted, leading to impaction colic, one of the main causes of death in domestic horses. Here's a fact few people know. Horses don't drink water at random. They have preferred moments of the day to hydrate, and ignoring that natural rhythm can confuse even experienced caretakers. You may have noticed that many horses drink only after eating or right after exercise, and sometimes refuse water even when they seem thirsty. There's a physiological reason for that behavior. A horse's digestive system is designed to stay in balance. When the stomach is too full, drinking large amounts of water can cause discomfort or even mild reflux. That's why horses prefer to drink between meals or right after movement, when their bodies naturally demand replenishment. Studies have shown that horses with constant access to clean water, not just at scheduled times, drink more and maintain better physical performance. And it's not just about quantity. Temperature matters too. If the water is too cold, the horse tends to drink less. If it's too warm, the flavor and smell change, reducing the urge to drink. The perfect range is between 50 and 70 degrees Fahrenheit, where intake naturally increases. Sound also plays a role. Horses are sensitive to noise, and some avoid loud, automatic waterers, preferring quiet buckets instead. Small details like this can make a difference of dozens of liters per day. Hydration can also be a diagnostic tool. A horse that suddenly starts drinking more than usual may be showing early signs of kidney issues, equine diabetes, or fever. On the other hand, a horse that drinks less than normal could be under stress, in pain, or reacting to contaminated water. That's why attentive caretakers observe not just how much a horse drinks, but how he drinks. Long, calm gulps indicate comfort, while short, quick sips can suggest anxiety or discomfort. Veterinarians often use a simple hydration test called the skin tent test. Gently lift the skin on the horse's neck and release it. If it takes more than two seconds to return to place, the horse is dehydrated. In the end, water is the invisible foundation of a horse's life. It lubricates joints, carries nutrients, supports digestion, and regulates body temperature. A healthy horse is first and foremost a well-hydrated one. More than just numbers, understanding how and when your horse drinks means understanding his most natural and silent behavior. If you found these insights helpful and learned something new about your horse's behavior, please like this video and consider subscribing to Inside Horses. It helps YouTube recognize that this content matters and share it with more horse enthusiasts. Tell us in the comments, how much water does your horse usually drink per day? Have you ever noticed any strange changes in his drinking habits? And if you know someone who loves learning about horses, share this video with them.